October is National Pizza Month, so we are celebrating the Zah throughout the month, and why not? Americans love our pizza, and we are used to big portions like, you know, the Big Gulp and Big Mac and all that. All that stuff. But our Michelle Oliver found a slice that dwarfs them all at Big Al's Pizzeria in Dearborn Heights. Check it out. Here at Big Al's, they like to go big. I mean really big. I think this is bigger than my torso. It's different. It's gargantuan. Not a lot of pizzerias around here have it. How would you go about eating this? I try to eat it like a regular pizza. Let me take a bite for you. Yeah. Hold it at one end with uh, my right hand, bottom hand on the left. That's so crazy. It's difficult. Very difficult, but it's so good. Let's talk to one of the men who invented it, Big Al himself. We want it to be different. We wanted to stand out. We didn't want to be like every other pizza place in the area. And we were sitting down, me and a good friend of mine, Fred Serini, and my partner, when we were coming up with ideas, shooting them back and forth to each other, and he said, why don't you guys do something like a gigantic slice of pizza? Me and my partner and I looked at him like, man, you're nuts, what, do you, what does that even mean? What do you mean a big slice of pizza? And he gave me a, a pan that he actually custom built for us. We tried it, it worked, I had to make me a few more, the big slice came about. To tell you the truth, uh, it just blew up. <laughs> that, was, that was just it. I mean, Instagram was blowing up. Everybody wants to try it. So how do you make a giant slice of pizza? So we start with our dough, all homemade in-house. Now you want to start by stretching the dough in the slice position. In the slice position? Yep. So all right. Just get it flattened out in a big triangle. So is this equivalent to about a large pizza in terms of dough? Uh, that's about one and a half. One and a half of yeah, a large? One and so a it half. is huge even even in regular pizza sizes. Yeah, oh yeah, it's, it's, this is a big pizza. I mean, we're talking 24 inches. Now, on to the sauce. So we're gonna not leave crust all over. Uh, we're just leaving we crust up top like yep, a slice. We want it to be as sliceful as possible. We also top it with cheese and pepperoni, but you can get it topped with whatever you'd like. Then into the oven it goes, and it comes out perfectly baked. Will this even fit in that box? It won't, but that's, this is the biggest box they make. You're gonna have to slide. There you go. You done this before? I did once You've work at a pizza before. place. <laughs> With the dusting of Parmesan cheese, it's ready to be devoured. Well, bon appetit. <laughs> oh, I won't get it off. <laughs> that's really good pizza. How much I thought of that you were going to fall over. Yeah, it I was, was like, oh, no. oh boy. Well, Michelle is here with us in studio <laughs> and had Big Al's Pizzeria bring a spread for us to check out yes. because they offer a lot more than just pizza. So what do we have here? So we have the big slices like you saw in the piece. We also have a calzone. Mm. It's a steak calzone. It ooh, looks really good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And then they have roasted chicken. And this reminds me of my childhood, Bosco sticks. Oh wow, that's right, right up front. Yep, yeah. right up front right there. All right. The cheese, cheese filled breadsticks. Nice, well, while nice. we wait, uh, Kevin's gonna change the battery on his close up camera. Okay, okay. so we're uh, gonna start with the. Are we gonna try these? Yeah, let's yeah. do it. Yeah, let's do oh God, something that requires so heavy. a big thing. All right, All right. here, we, here go. we go. Ready, so we're gonna right. cheers. Cheers, cheers our pizza. <laughs> <laughs> this is heavy. Yeah. <laughs> you get a workout as you eat. <laughs> now all the toppings right. on this are halal for anyone who has any pork allergies or who just wants to avoid pork. Right. This is good. <laughs> no, this is delicious. Mm. Do you like it? Yeah. I do like it. And guys, I'll get to try pepperoni. I've never had that yes, before. Yes, you can have a pepperoni mm. pizza. Um, this is good. I want to talk about this calzone because okay. I walked I by this. Gonna... And Isn't that calzone amazing looking? Look at this right here. I, it stopped me dead in my tracks. Those are pepperoncinis. You got some tomatoes and lettuce there mm -hmm. and some cheese melting out that the side. That's good. That's what caught my eye. So, so yeah. they like bake the calzone, open it up, and then put the lettuce and the tomato in? To be honest, I don't know how they make that. Wow. I was busy focused though. on the giant pizza. pizza. Yeah, this <laughs> is kind of a great sell. And yes, then oh, we missed the one piece. last one. We have loaded fries over here with uh, chicken on them, cheese, ranch, and barbecue sauce, because why decide between the two when you can have both? I mean, I listen, That's true. delicious. <laughs> Big Al's Pizzeria is on the corner of Ford and Yes, Jay, you're going to ask me a question? Okay, sorry. <laughs> okay, Big Al's on the corner of Ford and Inkster in Dearborn Heights. I know I looked crazy talking to my producer. It was weird. Thank you, Michelle, so much.